Hello mga kids! Welcome back to Mathematics Grade 4. Always remember that math is fun and easy. Tara na! Simulan na natin. Fourth quarter, week 3, lesson 2. Learning competency finds the volume of rectangular verism using cubic meter and cubic centimeter. Before we proceed to our topic class, let us have first a short review. Answer the following question below. Question number 1. What is the area of the square if one side measure 10 cm? What is your answer? Very good. The answer is 100 cm squared. Number 2 question class. What is the area of the rectangle if the length is 10 cm and the width is 8 cm? What is your answer? Very good. 80 cm squared. The next question class, what is the area of a parallelogram with 10 cm base and 9 cm height? What is your answer? Very good, 90 cm squared. Let us proceed to our topic class. Find the volumes of rectangular perism. A rectangular perism is a solid figure that has 6 faces, 12 edges, and 8 vertices. Look at the illustration below class. The cube has length, width, and height. We use one cube equal to one cubic centimeter to visualize the volume of the cube. Let us study the following solid figure class. You can count the cubes to find the volume of a box. Look at the illustration below. One cube equal to one cubic unit. Two cubes, two cubic units. Four cubes equal to four cubic units. To find the volume of rectangular verism, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. Look at the illustration below. Let us find the volume of rectangular perism. The length of rectangular perism is 4 cube. The width is 2 cube and the height is 3 cube. To find the volume of rectangular perism, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. And then, substitute the value. Length equal to 4 cm cube, width 2 cm cube, and height 3 cm cube. Perform the operation. The volume of rectangular perism equal to 24 cm cube. Another way to find the volume of rectangular perism, you can count the number of cubes to get the volume of rectangular perism. By counting, there are 24 cubes in all. Before we proceed to our activity class, again, to find the volume of rectangular perism, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. Another way to find the volume of rectangular perism, you can count the number of cubes to get the volume of the rectangular perism. Counts the number of cubes to find the volume of rectangular perism. Look at the illustration below class. What is your answer? By counting, there are 4 cubes in all. Look at illustration number 2 class. Count the number of cubes to find the volume of rectangular perism. What is your answer? Very good. 8 cubes in all. Look at the next illustration class. Find the volume of rectangular perism by counting the cubes. What is your answer? Very good. 12 cubes in all. Look at the next illustration class. To find the volume of rectangular perism, count the number of cubes. What is your answer? Very good. 36 cubes in all. The next activity class. Use the formula to find the volume of rectangular perism. What is the volume of rectangular perism? If the width is 2 cm, the length is 3 cm, and the height is 5 cm. What is your answer? Very good. 30 cm cube. The volume of rectangular perism. The next illustration class. Find the volume of rectangular perism using the formula. The length is 4 cm, the width is 2 cm, and the height is 3 cm. What is your answer? Very good. 24 cm cube. The volume of rectangular perism. Look at the next illustration class. Find the volume of rectangular perism 
the length is 6 cm, the width is 6 cm, and the height is 8 cm. What is your answer? Very good. 228 cm cube. The volume of rectangular perisem. Look at the next illustration class. Find the volume of rectangular perisem with the length of 10 cm, the width is 4 cm, and the height is 6 cm. What is your answer? Very good. The volume is 240 cm cube. The next illustration class. Find the volume of rectangular perisem with the length of 12 cm, the width is 5 cm, and the height is 6 cm. What is your answer? Very good. 360 cm cube. The volume of rectangular perisem. The last problem class. The rectangular aquarium has 15 cm length, 10 cm width, and 12 cm height. What is the volume of the aquarium? What is your answer? How do you solve the problem class? First process, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. Next process, substitute the value length 15 cm, width 10 cm, height 12 cm and perform the operation. The volume of the aquarium is 1,800 cm3. That's all for today class. I hope you learned a lot. Always remember that math is fun and easy. Keep safe everyone.